Hey YouTube, I'm Aaron Ross, and this is a little bit different of a scene than you're used to seeing me in. So welcome to my staircase. Today we are doing something inspired by Aaron Outdoors on Instagram. She's been doing a series called Our Great Indoors, since we're all stuck indoors. They are these amazing scenes that she's creating inside of her house of little figurines that are inspired by scenes outdoors. I'll put a few of them up on the screen here. This is what we're going for. I don't know if we'll be able to achieve this level of detail and um, quality of image, but we're gonna try. So today I'm gonna try and do a waterfall scene. I have a couple different supplies here around me and I'm going to use my staircase as that waterfall. So this is gonna be a little bit of a time lapse watching me behind the scenes and then I will walk through my camera and what I'm using to capture the image once we get to that point. So let's go. All right, so that is going to be my scene. We've used some streamers, ribbons, things like that to make our waterfall and river in the background. We have leaves from some dead flowers that we had in the house that I crumpled up and used the twigs from those little leaves as the, as the campfire for our little character, which is Harry Potter, a uh, Lego set, Lego version. But, um, and it's on a background of a grocery bag that is brown and adds to that natural look. In terms of camera gear and how I am taking this photo, so I'm using the Fujifilm X-T3 and I've adapted a Nikon 50mm f2 lens and so that's a full frame 50mm so it's equivalent to about a 75mm so it gives me a little bit of that telephoto shallow depth of field so I'm going to be able to focus in on our character, Harry Potter, and blow out or blur out the background, the waterfall, and some of that to add to that sense of reality, even though this is arts and crafts on a staircase. So that is going to be what I'm using, and let's see how this turns out. <music> great indoors photo. Reminder that you can do this as well with what you already have at home. It doesn't matter. You can use the supplies that you have for grocery shopping like I did as well as some things from our gift wrapping drawers and arts and crafts closets and all sorts of things. I didn't buy a single thing for this photo shoot. Just use what I already had in the house. Remember to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and to just get started.